Good morning, Paul Case here. Uh, trying to get my cattle up and do a little cow working. And I've had a defugalty here, a little Red Bull that was shut up with the other three in the barn has uh, gotten out with the cows, broke part of my corral fence. <clears throat> so uh, it's gonna put result in uh, them being a little bit more shut up here. I don't know if there's a, I'm sure there's a cow in heat. I've had a couple of three that have been showing heat. And so, uh, that's probably why you done it. But I was trying to get them up and catch a bunch of my calves so that I could work the calves and, uh, move some of the heifers. But I don't know if I caught any of the heifers calves. This is going to be a, day worth of figuring out i didn't catch them but there's a possibility they would come back in I, I think there was eight that stayed out there may have been nine but i've only got 18 or 19 calves so <clears throat> anyway that's how that's looking the little red bull calf is trying to ride things out there and so i think uh and I think I've caught him stealing. I'm thinking I might just put him in with these others. He'll have a month with them, a little more than a month with them. And then uh, Scott could take and turn him out with something on his place. Scott was wanting him, and I don't know. If Scott turns out to not want him, I'll be happy to haul him off, I guess. Bringing good money right now is the only saving grace to that. See that sucker following that cow that was beating up on him. And he had tried to mount her right here. <laughs> yeah, she didn't have none of it. <clears throat> and that's far enough away that my phone camera don't get it really good. But I'm going to let them finish eating here. And then we're going to see what calves we caught and what heifers we've caught. Yeah, see, there's a little one trying to ride the other bull. I'm afraid he might be hard on my other calves that I've got here, so. Anyway, that's kind of where we're at right here. I'm, I've got my mom and dad's place, and I've got 40 next to it. So I got 80 acres uh, down there, which is as much pasture as what I've got here on this place. <clears throat> but I've got 33 mama cows on this 80, and they're just keeping right up with it. We have we we're short on moisture again, and that could all change just in a few days, I know. But um, I was wanting to take some down there and take advantage of having that extra pasture that's down there too <clears throat> so i gotta get out here in a few minutes i'm gonna sit here and drink coffee till they quit eating feed and when they quit eating feed i'm gonna go see how many of the cows i can separate out the gate down there and then we'll uh get the rest of them up here in this pen and separate them off i, I have to go in there and fix that fence right there that he tore up but I don't think that'll be a huge thing I can I think it'll push back in I may have to take the loader around there and push on it but if I happen to have gotten all the calves that belong to the heifers that have calved which I don't think I did um, I may not have to do this again until the end of April another month away and I could get them better acquainted with coming in here. I've got one old black cow that she likes to stand right by the gate. And if you back the truck back out the gate, she goes out the gate. So, <clears throat> just kind of aggravating. I've got a few of them that are going to the stockyard. I bought them as old cows and they're, they're dead gummed aggravating. But it's worked out okay here. So, 
we'll just go with that so i'll bring you back out in a little bit maybe we'll get a little video of working some of these calves here after a bit tagging and vaccinating heifers is real easy so painful less than a minute mm, eating like a king you see any of them devil pretty well hidden there's the small ones that's left look at that great big old thing just jump through the fence You gotta go somewhere else, you're getting cut up in the neighbor fence. I'll go try to get my cows up here. See if I can't get me a few more heifers paired up. I got at least three out here that have calves on them. So, uh, I'll give it another try. Here goes nothing. So we're checking cows and I don't know if you guys can even see them. It's a whole stinking herd of deer over there. Can you count how many there are? I don't think that's all of them. I bet there's 25 of them over there or more. You go telling me it ain't challenging to grow hay. Huh. I guess some people could just mistakenly do it so we're out checking cows how many you got i don't know i haven't even started <laughs> me neither it's hard to count them around the ring though Neighbors are shooting guns. Well, I'll bring you back in a little bit. Tip checking. Cow checking. Now following the truck, making it difficult. Because I've been feeding them, trying to get them where I catch them. And we have one calf out here that hasn't been worked. And I have no doubt I'll catch him eventually, but. Everything else is gonna have green tag. yesterday
That's about it. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.